I'm from the Philippines. I'm from Phoenix. Together, Together we're Phil's to Phoenix. Phoenix. Two countries. One heart. Welcome, Welcome to, to our, our weekly Chica Chica. Chica. Hey, we got that first try. Good job. Okay, it's Monday noon. Yeah, it's Monday noon. Yesterday was kind of... Crappy. Yeah, kind of a crappy day. Not feeling uh, well. That with the upcoming trip, everybody's kind of on edge and a little bit emotions and a little bit, yeah, it's, it's exciting, scary, and others all at once, so. Yeah. So, what we do last week, or yesterday? Well, the fourth, we actually did stay home and we kind of watched, uh. Love stories. Love stories. <laughs> Filipino love stories. He was stuck. He does not have a choice. <laughs> Thank heavens for closed captioning. I'm glad they have subtitles, right? So that's what we do. Uh, and we did, um, we actually... That, went, that morning we went to Denny's. We had breakfast, yes. Uh, I was kind of surprised. The Denny's, the, the service was a little bit off. The food wasn't terribly great. Yeah, I guess because there's a, a lot of people. And, and I'm thinking that's what it was. They were a little bit short-staffed and that they were kind of scrounging to get people. But Yeah, but the pork chop was really good. The grilled pork chop for the dinner. Oh, that we made really, for dinner? Really good. So we bought some... Uh, Pork chops that we did grilled pork chops for dinner. That was really cool. Yep. We put them on the grill, and I got me a steak, though. Yeah. So that's our Thursday. Friday, I went to my um, dinner with my office mate. That's like golden years because they're around 50s plus. So that was amazing. We went to Carwambas, Mexican food. Saturday, what we went, what we do for Saturday? Just... Errands. Saturday, yeah, it was just an errands day that we didn't get a whole lot done. Yeah, because we, we... We got a lot done, but not... Yeah, yeah, and then Buddy came over for watching movie, the How to Train the, Dragon. Uh, my son and I, my son, the, the three of us have been watching the How to Train Your Dragon series from start to finish. It was cool. It was the, really he's cool. really into the anime scene, and it's really cool, and he's gotten different gifts for us along those scenes, and it's it's really neat. I like it's, it. Uh, Different. It's a real cool bonding time with everybody. Yeah, and it's a different learning too, and it's a different. Yeah, it, it is a good bonding. It is. And yesterday, what we do? Just cleaning, particularly like you did a, did a lot of in-depth cleaning. We did, did some of the cleaning Saturday too. Yes, and then. Um, oh yeah, we bought the frame for Buddy picture frame. Oh yeah, we got we got a. Uh, I, I've had it stuck on a shelf forever that since 2012 when he graduated that have been stuck on a bookshelf outside of a frame but we've got a graduation picture of my son yeah and we finally went down and got a frame for that and got it hung up finally <laughs> I guess he appreciated it when was seven years late <laughs> he graduated 2012 I know and then I'm looking forward for my graduation picture for my master's yeah, I'm not going to wait for eight years to put that up, so I don't... <laughs> I'll promise to put it up wherever, you know, wherever we go. But anyways, um, what else? Um, uh, in our year, have eight days to go for your... Eight days to go. And mine is less than 30 days. Oh, the, I'm so excited. Yeah, this time tomorrow, or this time next week, we're definitely going to have to record Chica Chica on Sunday. Because it's going to be the last minute packing arrangements because I leave at 4 in the morning or 5 in the morning the next the next morning. Yeah. Yep. That was... Yep. That, that I have was. a 5.30 a.m. flight time, so... You, you will be packing this weekend, so... For yourselves. And I'll start packing mine just in case, so... Yeah. It would be exciting. And just kind of check... Uh, just kind of get that ready. Uh, that... Yeah. We talked about it. Rusi has a uh, classic 250 that I'm going to get a hold of them this week. The Rusi car car. I'm going to see if I can get a hold of them this week and see about getting one and what it would take to get one there. Yeah. And what it's going to take to actually buy one. True. And what's the other news? We're planning to invest buying a lawn. We're going to do. That's the other big thing that I. We're just uh, planning. It's not decided yet but uh her brother Jemler and his wife invested in one yeah and it's what 100 square meters 200 200 square meter lot yeah it's like a 200 square meter lot uh it's 200,000 pesos down 
and 10,000 pesos a month yeah. for five years. Yep. And we're hoping, expecting, thinking that we're definitely going to take a look at it and, and make a decision. Uh, her brother and sister-in-law put a boarding house. Uh, yeah, like a four, it's like apartment studio type. Um, like studio apartments. Yeah, and I'm excited for that too. We'll see. The PMP has a training camp right there, uh, boot camp, basic, whatever you want to call it, right there, so that they've always got people coming in looking for an inexpensive place to stay. Uh, if we get it, probably we'll do a little bit nicer house All right, yeah. do, and do it as a house. Because we can go and stay. And put it on Airbnb, but that'll give us a nice place to stay when we go back to visit family. I, yeah, I agree, and I would say I like, because it's close to the ocean, too, and yeah, definitely, like, for visits or for people who want to come and see my hometown, at least we have rooms and space for them, <laughs> just in case. We never uh, know. We have a lot of friends here in the U.S. Well, so. and Cindy, Cindy's made comments that there's going to be a lot more of uh, expats, yeah. expats living in there, so this would give them a place to start from and stage out of. Yeah. Uh, there's that big Somalia shrine that a lot of people go to visit. Yeah. And this would give kind of a, a nice little place to be fairly close to that. And Sabonga is a place where you can get to pretty much anywhere in southern Cebu fairly quickly. Yeah. It's a neat town. Little town. So, but that's yeah, our we... plan. Yeah, you know, that's kind of our plans at the moment. And... We will be posting videos when we're in Sibonga, uh, the fiesta, and we'll yes. keep you posted. That I get there the 18th. I land the 18th, and I'm going to be dead. Yeah. So but dead. after that, I plan on trying to post a little bit, maybe a five-minute video you know, yeah. each day, and still keep to the Monday, Wednesday, Friday schedule. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry about dropping the ball this last couple of weeks, but... Uh, we were sick for for a week. We're not feeling well, but uh, and then just trying to get everything organized and ready. Yep. So that would be it, right? But that's basically up to date at this point. Next week's is going to be kind of fun. Yep, I'm excited. And the end of the week is actually going to be really cool. Cool. Mabuhai. Ma